Magnus Anderson Short Sounds Nosak Records 2001, a video channel dedicated to contemporary guitar music, can't in any way neglecting the contribution that Magnus Anderson, Swedish guitarist with studies at the Trinity College of Music in London, gave to new music. Let's think just about that in 1984 he found a guitar class in Ferien Kurse für Neue Musik in Darmstadt, where he taught until 1996. In 2001 he produced for the Swedish record label, independent label NOSAG, this CD entirely dedicated to the guitar repertoire of Italian composers like Franco Donatoni, Aldo Clementi, Bussotti, Bruno Maderna and Luciano Berio. This is an absolutely essential album that traces essential lines for the interpretation of these passages because of, the, of his personal music imprinting that this musician uh, gifted with, by a crystalline class and intelligence can express through his instruments. The title, Short Sound, could not be more appropriate. This record seems to highlight a college of small, fragmented, broken-up sounds added to each other to become something comprehensive and monumental, beginning, beginning with a phone material consisting of a, sh a short generic lick borrowed from the jazz guitarist Django Reiner for Algo by Donatoni, and through the metamusical dimension of Dodici Variazioni and Fantasia, for Aldo Guitar by Aldo Clementi. Magnus explores the harmonic possibilities in Ides Pues, the Andalusian piece composed by Maderna for a ten-string guitar, while Beautiful is his version of Rara by Silvano Bussotti, a piece characterized by a particular score graphic form that tests to the limit the musician's capacity and his creative possibilities. Possibilities heavily stressed also in sequenza number 9 and in the two versions of Breen composed by Luciano Berio. In this album, dance silences alternate between musical aphorism and kaleidoscopic instrumental colors in an amalgam of concentrated sound emission in search of what appears to be the essential in music. A research that go behind the intransigence of abstract sound architecture, which creates a third dimension through which space exists only for imagination and intellect, and opens a windows on the finest poetry. A record that got the attention of the prestigious British magazine The Wire, a cult for the musical avant-garde. Thanks for watching, please support and follow noigitas.com.